Hey everybody, how's everyone doing tonight in YouTube land? This is the uh, Iron Range Geek Reviews. And tonight I am going to be doing a review on Transformers, Earthrise, Ramjet, and Dirge. But first, we'll take a look at the packaging. Let's move these guys. Oop. Out of the way. And here is the uh, box for uh, Ramjet and Dirge. It's a very nice box, I do say. And, um, Anyways, uh, I want to talk about some of the issues that people ha have been uh, getting while getting this, this box. This is an Amazon exclusive. And um, just want to say that, you know, people have been having uh, stickers like right on the front of the box or even on the back of the box like anywhere on the back of the box but anyways yeah this is a nice box you know you got the uh, ramjet and dirge right here and i think right in the background you get thrust picture of the arc you know it says transformers earthrise ramjet and dirge Transformers. I uh, get all that Earthrise characters right here. Up right here. And here's the back of the box. Right here. Ramjet and Dirge. Right there. And that's about it for the box and I gotta fix up my scenery here and here is ramjet and dirge there they are in their plane modes i don't know what kind of plane they are but uh yeah i do think they're pretty good they are the two uh, uh, cone heads from the from the G1 cartoon, and you know as you see all the nice molded detail for this, and they they are the same thing as or the same mold as the other Seeker jets like Starscream, Thundercracker, and Skywarp, but. But they're, uh, they added a little different, different stuff to, to them. The core, core molding, which is basically all this stuff here. They just added or redid the, like this stuff right here. And even the leg panelings even longer. I don't know, and, um, you know, looks all nice, you know, you got that nice kind of, uh, maroonish red, or, can't say it's blood red, well, I don't know, you got that nice Decepticon logo there, the white, with the faded gray, And well, some nice black right here. Some transparent orange. Some black for the nose cone right there. And it's the same thing. Underneath, you got that red for the heels right here and here. The gold. 
and some gold underneath, but that's mainly for robot mode. Now, let's take a look at Dirge. And he's all blue. And he's is almost all blue, I should say. You, you have that, uh, let's see, kind of like a very dirty yellow. Or a uh, very tan or whatever. And, um... It's got some black right here. Some transparent orange for the cockpit. And... Let's see. He's got some black right there. Looks like he's a little bit of uh, paint bleeding off. But, you know, it is what it is. I'm not... Complain about it. You know, you got the, your Decepticon symbol there. And then on the underside, you got the same thing. You know, you got your white, kind of like a purplish right here. You got the gold. Same, same thing at the top, right here. In here. And, uh... You know, you have your black uh, guns or photon lasers, whatever they are. You know, same same thing on uh, Ramjet here. Now, let's uh, transform to, let's get them into robot mode. Well, they transform pretty much the same as the regular... Uh, other seekers. So what we do here is take off the weapons, off the wings. You know, you got your ports right there. You can place any of these guns, you know, like I showed. Like uh, right here or here. Or you can place them back here or here or here or here. Or you can even, you know, be silly and have one on top. You know, that's up to you. Display it however you want. But, anyways, let's get to transformation. First of all, what you want to do is fold these up, you know, for clearance sake fold these up and then fold it up and then do the same thing on this side just like that and now you go to this side Pull these two out just like that. And then what we do here is pull the legs apart just like that, away from the tabs. You know, like right here and here. And they can attach back in these little holes right here. And then what you do here is tab in the legs. Like, in, on that tab to that hole, right there. And so you just gotta get it all lined up here. And then you do the same thing on the other side. Split the legs. And transform the feet. Right here and here. And let's stand them up. have to get up like this and now we gotta split right here because this is clipped on right here and it hooks behind here in jet mode and in robot mode too so what you do and then 
take the nose cone here and lean it forward like so and then what you do here is fold out the arms like so just like so and then you come forward and then you twist it right at the base right here and then you put this this long piece right into that little hole right down there see it'll go right down and there and then just kind of line everything up and then fold back the jet nose cone there we go that see fold it back you can see that we build the head And now, for the arms, just kind of fold. Oh, sorry about that, the camera fell over. I gotta get all situated here. There we go. Now, for the arms here. What you do here is unfold it like so and then see in jet mode that tab will go right into that little slot right down there and now what you do is extend the arm now we put that tab right there and put it right in that little slot right there. And then bring down the arm. I'll put in his his gun right in this this port because that's where it belongs. And I'll do the same on this one. See, bring this down, this arm down, fold it up, or pull it out, like so, extend, bring it down, and bring, and clip it right in that hole, right there. And put in his other other uh, gun. Now, for for uh, dirge, I'll have kind of have to do him off camera. So I'll be back in two shakes of a lamb's tail. Ah, right, I'm back. Now we've got both Ramjet and Dirge in their robot modes. And, you know, I think they're pretty good. They are the Coneheads. And they are an, an, an uh, Amazon exclusive. And I do say they, you know, I always say they do look good. They are what they are. And they are... Uh, Kind of like repaints, remolds of the other Seekers. You know. 
but you know I'm not complaining and I know we're supposed to get a earthrise uh, uh, thrust sometime but don't know when but anyways let's take a look at at uh, Ramjet here let's set him to the side for set dirge to the side for a quick second all right see looks pretty good you know you got your Decepticon symbol right there all nice detail in the legs the black and then you have your gold the red you know up the legs he's Kind of like an ivory color, you know. It's got some nice molded detail for the arms. And the paint is pretty good. A little bit. I could have used one more. But, you know, I don't complain about that. About, you know, how the paint is. You know, these could have been plain for all I care. It could have just been plain white or gray. Doesn't matter to me. They're a playable figure. But, uh, anyways, let's take a look at that face right here. See that nice uh, head sculpt there? That red, red beady eyes there. It's looking at you. Yeah, he's definitely a conehead. And I'm not referring to the uh, Dan Aykroyd conehead version either. Yeah, but anyways, here's his articulation. Head can go back and forth. Can turn on a little bit, but I don't dare. Arms can go up, down, it's got rotation at the arms, you know, can go probably a full 360. It's got upper arm rotation, does have mm, 90 degree, and there's no wrist rotation, just up and down due to transformation and he can do if you move this hip skirt up you can do a high kick and kick back a little bit and he has uh, hmm, about 90 degrees of bend from with the knee and he does have ankle tilts it's one thing I always like you know and then these do move as well you know if you're putting them on a shelf and you don't have that shelf space you can put these like that if you want to that way I usually keep them out you know and for for uh, dirge here like I said he's same thing as ramjet but he's got a different face sculpt like like he's yelling you know he's like ah Ah, 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 or he's like singing in the opera, like ah, but yeah, he's got you know different wings, you know, he's got. Alright, gotta put these in back. 
See, these can move in back as well. See, that don't make them like back heavy or nothing. But like I said, if you don't have shelf space, you can always move these in, in back. And I'll make them stand like that. But me, I keep them out like that. And he does have his his guns right here. We can go bang, bang, shoot, shoot, fire, fire. You know, same thing with Ramjet over here. He does have his guns where he can go shoot, shoot, bang, bang, pow, pow, whatever. But, you know, all in all, these two are great figures. And if you do, if uh, Amazon does still have them, get them. You know, they're worth it. I think they're, are, they are worth getting for your uh, Earth, Earthrise collection. And uh, let's see what else. Uh, Um, hmm. See what else I can think of is, uh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um. Uh, yeah, these, like I always say, these two make a great addition to your seeker collection. But, uh, anyways, these are an Amazon.com exclusive. So if you do want to get. Ramjet and Dirge, they are still available at Amazon.com. If not, you're going to have to wait. But, anyways, uh, please hit that like button and please subscribe to the Iron Range Geek Reviews and this has been the Iron Range Geek Reviews, and I am signing. Ah!